morning, chill ladies. My name is Jack Sipti and welcome to my first proper actual drumming video. I know I did a vlog a little while ago, whenever this was actually recorded, and I played around in them a small bit, but that was just kind of me messing around and whatever came to my head at the time and just showing you how they sounded. But this time I'm actually going to sit down and play a song from start to finish, and this is something I've wanted to do for a really, really long time, and a lot of people have been asking for it ever since they found out that I played drums, and now that I actually have a kit, a lot of people have been asking for it again, so I'm going to try it. I don't know how this is gonna go. I don't even know how to start recording it. I don't know how any of this sort of stuff works. So it'll hopefully get better as time goes on. Um, the, the visuals of the video and like the camera angles and the sound and trying to mix it all together and make it an actual watchable experience. But I'm gonna start off the, the drum cover type videos with a song that means a lot to me, which is Chop Suey by System of a Down. And the reason I'm- well, there, I wanted to do an intro to this video as well, and not just the song. That's gonna come! Um, you, you'll be able to skip ahead to actually watch that if you don't care about any of this stuff. But the reason I'm doing Chop Suey in particular is because that was the first song- I had an interest in drums before, and I had an interest in just music and everything already. But Chop Suey was the first heavy metal song that I ever actually enjoyed. I remember I was at home one day and Kerrang! TV was on. And they used to just play, like, heavier types of songs, and then, I can't remember what other music channels I would watch, but they would proliferate some metal in. Um, System of a Down were considered some sort of, like, alternative metal kind of band at the time. Really weird classification. But they kind of blended in and bled into the other channels, and I ended up, this song came on, and it was so fucking weird and wacky the first time I heard it. And it just, it just hooked into me. It, like, some of the people that heard the song and they're like, what the hell is this? But to me, it just, like, it stuck in me and I was like, this is cool! I really like this! And I used to listen to it any time I came on with my friend, who was kind of getting into metal music at the same time. So it was the first proper metal song that we had heard, and really enjoyed, because everything else at the time sounded just like, <laughs> and we didn't get it. Um, nowadays I love that stuff, but Chub Suey was my first foray into heavy metal music. And it was my first foray into the style of drumming that I ended up having as I was progressing. And it was really like the stepping stone for everything that would come after that. And there was a funny time, my brother, my oldest brother, he used to play drums uh, a long time ago and he played a lot of different bands and a lot of different types of music. But he came over to visit from England one time. Uh, he came back for like a few days and this song came on and I was like, I wanted to impress my brother. Because he always seemed super cool to me. And this song came on the TV and I, I kept thinking in my head, I wonder if he knows this song, I wonder if he likes this song. So I turned up the song really, really loud on the TV, and my brother heard it in the kitchen and came running in, grabbed the remote off me, turned it up even more, and started like headbanging all around the room. And he was surprised that I liked the song, and I was surprised that he liked the song, and then that started off this like really great bonding session between us that... I don't know, it, like, that was like one really common ground that we finally got on board with, because before that, we, we never really had something to talk about, like, that interested both of us, and then, the next time he came back, or maybe it was that trip, um, another time he came back, he gave me that album, the, the Toxicity album, and I, that, that's like one of my favorite albums ever made, even today, I love every song on that album, and it's just so good, it's timeless, I could listen to that over and over again, so, that's why I'm doing this song today, um, so I'm just gonna get into it, sorry for all the rambling, but I felt like it was a, a good story to tell, so let's go drumming! A rolling suicide. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah. <sighs>